Hello guys, this is Oblivion Gamer here, and today I'm going to be doing another movie review because Polar Express has been going to crap, and uh, today I'm in my new location where I'm going to be filming on my white sofa. VIP is frick. So today I'm going to be doing a movie review on a film called A Kind of Murder, a Patrick Wilson movie. It's some, he's been in like The Conjuring and stuff. So yeah, let's begin with the film, I think. Um, all the stack house is rich and so sort of happily married to the beautiful but damaged Clara. His desire to be free of her feeds his obsession with chemo. A man suspect, suspected of brutal murdering his own wife. But when Clara is found dead in suspicion, circumstances brought us strings on lies and his own guilty thoughts seem enough to cut him conned him as his life becomes dangerously entwined with Kimmel's a ruthless cop it is increasingly prominent. He has found a cop track that in water and his aims to nail for his murder. See, it's those types of films where you think at the start it's going to be really good but it's all right when you watch it it's one of those types of films i mean the film was good i mean i would only recommend it to a patrick wilson fan or like film noir fan i wouldn't recommend it to like country fans or anything you know what i mean for seeing the film's actually quite a low seeing the film's quite low rated i think it's got a pretty solid cast it's got um hayley bennett who, who plays ellie in it and She's been in like The Girl on the Train, she's been in Magnificent Seven, and she was also a uh, Mandy in Equalizer, if you ever seen it, it's uh, Denzel Washington. Mm, the director is not actually that big, because um, he's like, I think that's his like first big film, I think, because he's, he's directed something called Set Fire to the Stars, and um, an ITV series, and that's like her uh, art. UK TV channel and we have series on it like Netflix do and there's a series called The Level he directed that yeah but what I thought the film what I thought the film would be good is um it was based in the uh, 1960s and um one of my favourite films is called Legend and genius idea listen to yourself Ron you're fucking nuts People who live in glass houses shouldn't throw stones. In the 1960s, well, not me, but set in the 1960s, I would definitely recommend it. That's all I've got today, I guess. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please smash a like. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you in the next video.